Help. We'll keep him busy. Knox, over here. Quickly, again. Here it comes. I got your back. Here you go. Let's go. The hour is come. Set forth with my blessing, Prince Noctis. Thank you, Your Majesty. Take your leave and go in the grace of the gods. Right. <sighs> Well, princes will be princes. So much for royal protocol. Not like you had the formal address. Your Highness! What now? I fear I have left too much unsaid. You place a great burden on those who would bear with you. <laughs> You're one to talk. I ask not that you guide my wayward son, merely that you remain. Indeed, Your Grace. We'll see the Prince to Altissia as thing we see. Yeah, what he said. Hate to break this up, but Kor's got the motor running. Drados, he's in your hands. And another... Do mind your manners around your charming bride-to-be. Your Majesty as well. Try to mind yours around our esteemed guests from Niflheim. You have no cause for concern. Nor do you. Take heed. Once you s you cannot turn back. You think I would? I need only know that you are ready to leave home behind. Don't know about you, but I'm ready as I'll ever be. Take care on the long road. Wheresoever you should go, the line of loose is you. Walk tall, my son. I think we can forget about hitching our way there. Thought people were friendly outside of the city. You, know, you can only go so far on the kindness of strangers. You're just gonna have to push her all the way. I've already pushed myself to the brink of death. You get up. <sighs> Come on, car isn't gonna move itself. Sheesh. Uh, I thought the car was supposed to be nice. Can it? Ready, steady. Oh.
so heavy. Believable. No be a fairy tale beginning, huh, Prince Noctis? We let ourselves get carried away. Look, these things happen. Let's just hope this isn't some omen. Gladio, do me a favor. What? Push this thing by yourself. All by myself? You won't even notice if we just let go. Don't even think about it. Save some breath for pushing. Ignis, can I switch? Nuh-uh. We just switched back there. And it's knocked. His turn. Oh, my hands are killing me. You'd rather I kill Easy there, tough guy. Any luck? Only a busy signal. Hold the phone. Is it just me, or was it supposed to be way closer? I assure you, the map is- Hammerhead was right there. Literally, next door. Looks that way. On a map- world. <sighs> the world's a big old place. Filled with wonder. Uh, tell that to my legs. You guys even pushing? Hard as I can. With everything I've got, we'll be there in time. Kept a girl waiting. Now, which one's the prince? Aha! Hello, your highness. Congratulating. Not hitch just yet. Lady Luna Frey, here in her head. Apologies for taking so long. <laughs> you best save your apologies. Well, that makes you. Cindy, Grease Monkey Granddaughter. Roll her in while I'm still. Didn't your daddy tell you? She's a custom, not some beat up old clunker. Prince knocked it. Uh, yeah. Prince. Like they took your old man and kicked the dignity out of him. What? You got a long way to go, son. And that slack, and you know we're fast. She's gonna take a while. Y'all get her in and run <sighs> Y'all heard him. Let's get moving. Right this way. Now we play the waiting game. Never liked that game. Never any good at it either.
Y'all ain't never been out this way before, have you? Go on, have a look around. This'll make sure y'all don't get lost. Well, might as well use of the extra time. Whoa! They got Ebony out here! Oh, Ignis is gonna f Wait, uh, what's a kill? Take a look at our wares. Thank you. 
A moment, knock. We've expanded the light. Just we confer with Cindy. Broken down and flat broke. Adding insult to injury. Ends in for both after charging us that. Yeah, let's pay him a visit. For a while. It's something? A uh, bit steep for a Sunuk. Oh, now I get it. This is what Papa meant when he said he was gonna teach them a lesson. Told me he had to take care of some ornery varmints ruckus around there. I'd be happy to pay y'all services if you're up to the challenge. How about it? An easy way out. Good luck, Papa. But don't go running around after dark. The demons are liable to the shred. Here, this ought to be enough for a place to stay. Just between us, don't tell Papa. Let's say that. All right. Looks like we found our first targets. Ready, knock. Got all those arms at your disposal. Use them. Help stop. No. Yep. You're mine. Where did it? Well, you know. Excellent. On with.
They aren't gonna know what hit them. Hey! Haven't you ever heard? Yeah. Your best offense is a good defense. Huh? Impressive. Yep. All in together now. How about this? That wasn't so hard. It takes two. Let's get on with it. So, uh, where are we headed anyway? Nowhere until the repairs are done. Then we head for Golden Key. Then after that, we hop in before you know it. Lover boy's hitched. Wait for car repairs, then wet balls in the air. Got it. there. Give it your all. Hey, knocked! Warp strike to catch him off guard! Ha! Brilliant. Sure. Don't be late. Biggie! My pleasure. I think we can handle this. Come on. I got a date with a ah! couple noodles. Huh? Nice. Mission complete. Who could this be? Hello? Hey, it's Cindy. How goes the hunting? Actually, we just finished. That's great, because I got one more hunt for y'all. Only this time, it's for a person. Fella named Dave went off, and we ain't heard from him since. Reckon he staked out a spot in an old shack nearby. Old shack? Uh, oh, got it. We'll take a look. So, what did Cindy say? Needs us to find some Dave guy. He went missing? Not missing. Said he's holed up in that shack. <sighs> this. Jack over there. Not yet. Got a plan. Huh. 
Huh, what are we looking at? This creature is known as a saber tusk. It skewers prey with its tusks, extracting game from the safety and comfort of burrows. That's a bit heartless. Yeah, I don't think we'll be befriending it. Feisty little devils. Hey, who's out there? Well, and look who's in here. The man of the hour. Dave, right? <laughs> been looking for you. Didn't mean to cause you all a little. I've been stuck here on account of my sprained ankle. Yeah, something funny about them barbits. I gave them hell, but couldn't finish the job. Still one mean mud about. Well, y'all don't look much like hunters, but what do you say? Put that puppy to rest for me? Ah, uh, yeah. We'll take care of it. Well, y'all got guts, that's for sure. Let me tell you where I last saw them. Way to show some spunk. Now let's get ready to kick some tail. wise to rest up before we set out. Let's find a spot to make camp. The hunters are really out around here, huh? So they're the new Crown's Guard or something? Similar, though technically a civilian outfit. They've definitely seen a lot more action than we have. Uh... Is it cool? Crown's Guard outfits? Be worse not to. They made them especially for us. Even got a sweet insignia on them. In the Crown's Guard, your attire identifies you. So... Wear it with pride. And here we are. Let's call it a day. I'll see what I can whip up.
<laughs> Not bad. <sighs> Perfect timing. <laughs> Like a father to her. Ever since they got back, Sid's been the only one looking after her. Rather more than a middling mechanic can handle. All things considered, I'd say she turned out okay. Well, like any girl, you just need to treat her right. Treat her wrong and Sid'll stuff his wrench where the sun don't shine. Take care of the car and it will take care of us. Yeah, the car. So only so far a man can walk. Our Crown City upbringing didn't prepare us for this. Ugh. Pretend you're walking to the car. but not your run-of-the-mill breed. We'd best make quick work of it. Wait a sec. What? Scared, big guy? You ought to be, too. Things vicious. You sure? Looks tame to me. Yeah. Look out! Ah, ah! Uh! Yeah! Boss! Nice one. It's not over yet. <laughs> Ready for round two. Bring it. Gladio. Yeah. Nice work, Gladio. Yeah. Ah! No! Boto. Yeah. Yeah. I'm impressed. Uh, it's hey, Ignis, instructions. Boys, we're in the yeah. whole stretch. Don't go dying on me now. Uh. Time to talk. Uh. 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 
Knock! You hold it up? Yep. We all good? Better than good. Good to go. Ring, ring. Hello? Hey, Dave just called and said he's safe. Thanks for finding him. Okay. Nice work, y'all. By the way, the old girl's looking good as new. She'll be waiting at the garage. Gotcha. So, who's up next behind the wheel? Ignis should take it and never let go. It helps that he can keep four eyes on the dash. <laughs> I couldn't even keep one. Not sure I'd do any better. Put me in the driver's seat. Good. Because I need the legroom in back. Look where you're going! Didn't mean to do that. How far are we going? Got plenty of time to figure it out. Huh? It's rude to keep a girl waiting. You better apologize. What is that? A live hurricane! That thing's like half bird, half ship. You realize that's three halves. Well, that explain its size. <laughs> awesome in every sense. Real nice here. Yeah. How about a breather? Sorry about the wait. Ain't she pretty? She's almost too pretty for the road. She's back.
back. We should all get a picture with her. All the more reason to ride with care. Oh, and before I forget, would y'all mind making a little delivery for me? No, not at all. Perfect. Thought you'd say yes. So I already put it in the trunk. There should be a motel on your way to Galden. If y'all wouldn't mind giving that to the owner, that'd be swell. Grandpa like grandkid. Now that she's all polished up and ready for the road, would you care to take her for a little test drive, Noct? Sure. Why not? And I needn't remind you to exercise caution. Time to go. Mm -hmm. Everybody out. <sighs> Ready? Let's hit it. Mm. Hammerhead is like no garage ever. You know? One would expect no less of purveyors to the crown. Ah, <sighs> I'll miss it once this road trip's over with. Huh? There's no read it in me, please. I'm sure Cindy will be glad to look after your car. Oh, right. So, that's what this is about. If you need, I could always lend you the regalia. Whoa! <laughs> uh, thanks for the offer, but once we're back in the Crown City, I think I'd better score my own wheels. Well, I'd say that's far enough for today. Might be wise to leave the driving to me until we found our bearings out here. Y'all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, thank you kindly. We'll take it out of the trunk, so y'all just sit tight. Hmm? Uh, Umbra. Bringing us stuff. Had a boy. A dog can really track a scent. Certainly knows how to find us. You always know, boy. Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. Mm. 
so hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. Sure. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. All set. Take care out there. I know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? You don't say. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. Hmm? Oh, customer. You sure? We ain't got bed bugs or nothing. Done. Yeah. Broke a few bones in there. Uh, let me get this shot. Some. Oh, love the lighting. Uh. How are you today? Till next time. Man, that smells good. Welcome to the crow's nest. What would you like? So what would you like to know? These are some pretty tough customers. Good luck to you. Have a look at the menu. Good luck, boys. Welcome. Can I take your order? Can do. Bon appetit. Thank you. 
Thanks for your business. Should we fill up the gas tank now or take our chances? Y'all are looking well. Oh, hey, it's y'all. Time. Gladio, come on! Gotcha. Hold on a sec, sir. I found an envelope addressed to Meldasio inside the package. Meldasio? The Hunter HQ? Yes, sir. The head hunter ought to be around here somewhere. Mind making one more delivery? What do you say, Noct? Might as well while we're in the neighborhood. Well, look who it is. I really owe you boys one. Make that two. <laughs> Can't seem to catch a break. Yeah. yeah, looks like they found another one. Wait, uh... Found another what? Tag. Us hunters keep them on our person at all times as identification. What? In case you forget who you are? More like so no one else forgets who they were. Hunters lead a life of danger, and sometimes these tags are the only things that make it back in one piece. It's our job to deliver them to the families of the fallen. As it were, I came out here to do just that. <sighs> if y'all happen to find any tags lying around out there, would you do me a favor and send them my way? Yeah, sure. Word is, somebody spotted a tag around these parts. Try asking the local tipster. He'll point you in the right direction. <laughs> Those tags are heavy stuff. They certainly carry emotional weight. We'd best find and return them. And give the families peace of mind. Let's start by following up on that hot tip. There's more dangerous things prowling about these days. That over there? Welcome. You want something to eat? Happy to tell you about the area. 
Thanks for your business. I could eat a horse. Ain't nothing special, but I love. So, uh, you thinking to fairy tale Lady Lunafreya back to the Crown City? Nah, no need to rush to happily ever after. Wow. Still can't believe you're actually tying the knot, dude. How does it feel now that it's finally happening? Fine, I guess. Ah, uh, come on, you can't fool me. Any guy would be over the moon to marry her. No big deal. Yeah, whatever. from there. Maybe this way?
The hunt is on. Gladio! Nice work, Gladio! Can't stop now! What can I say? Yeah. Was that perfect or what? I'll give you that. Huh. Indeed. Found one already, huh? You done good. Just picking up the pieces, I guess. Well, try to keep your spirits up. Even though I ain't one to talk, I beat myself lives of the hunters I couldn't save. That's one of these tags means to me. They hurt. But if I let that grief keep me from looking for them, then their tags and their lives will be forgotten forever. And that's right. Well, that's why I tell all my hunters to collect any tag they see, and I expect you boys to go out and do the same. Better make tracks. Ignis! On my way. Evening already? Time flies when you're having fun. If you need a room, we got one. Let's call it a day. 
Soft beds, baby. I made sure I got the regalia's good side. What's the forecast? Clear skies with the top. For our next story, Freya Abrai has a statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart, leaving word of this coming peace, nor the pride I take in my betrothal, playing a part in this historic moment. On this occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to my duties as Oracle, but my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, you all, and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna F will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming. Please be advised that during phone as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course, formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So a marriage of... Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctir likes the idea. <sighs> What's that? I do? Buzz off. I see it too. That's Golden Key. Kind of dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, island. Nobody goes to Golden for an island, though. They go to kick back and get massages. And soon. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helped. Change. What do you mean for a change?
Huh. Take a look at our wares. Hey, what are you after this time? Pleasure doing business. I'll see you later. here. Take a look at the... Hello there. Come to Deep Blue Sea? Always a time.
Huh. I'm not. We got, we got a big one. Look at that thing. Wow, you did good. About time to line, ain't it? Always a pleasure. Good luck out there. No iron is wearing thin.
Knocked. Stop reeling. You did good. Uh, you can show a bit of and you know. Turn the rope to Not you can show a bit of emotion. Uh, the line's still okay, you think? Oh. Mm. I'm all fished out, and I haven't even fished. Not feeling ambitious. <laughs> 